In September 2017, SpaceX CEO Elon Musk revealed his latest aspirations for colonizing Mars. His plan is to send the first humans to Mars in 2024 to build the foundations for the first Martian city. But is Mars really the best place for humans to settle? Some scientists think that we should be looking elsewhere. I'm Amanda Hendricks. I'm a senior scientist with Planetary Science Institute. First of all, I, I don't want to be too negative about Mars. I like Mars. I do think we should go there and humans should go there to visit and check it out and do science. I just don't think it's a good place for living for long term. And the main reason is because of the radiation problem. And Mars uh, offers no natural protection against the galactic cosmic rays. It has a, a thin atmosphere and no magnetosphere. So um, humans who intend to spend any long period of time on Mars are probably going to have to live underground or in some sort of devices that can shield them from the galactic cosmic rays. Titan, on the other hand, has got this natural shielding device, which is its nice thick atmosphere. Amanda Hendricks believes the planet we should be looking into is Titan, a moon slightly bigger than our own that orbits Saturn. Because it's such a more um, appropriate environment for humans. Titan is really unique because it's a moon and it has a solid surface. It's mostly an icy moon, but it has this thick atmosphere. And it's uh, unique because there's no other moon in the solar system that has such an atmosphere. The atmosphere is mostly nitrogen. It's about one to 2% methane. So one thing to point out is there's no oxygen in the atmosphere like we have here on Earth. And so humans living on Titan would need to make oxygen to breathe. Shouldn't be a big problem because there's plenty of H2O frozen on the surface and in the subsurface. So humans could derive oxygen to breathe um, without a big problem. Perhaps um, a good option might be for them to try out a very temporary short-term colony of humans on Mars and use that as a stepping stone to Titan, use it kind of as a practice run. I think that would be a great idea. But somebody like Elon Musk has got the resources and the smarts to be able to, to work on Titan and to, to make a colony there happen and to make the, the propulsion system happen. And so I think he should be thinking about Titan more than Mars.